So actually what I wanted to do today is not only just ride the wheels and take pictures, but take pictures with my phone. That's not a cleaning cloth. Where's my cleaning cloth? There's this app called Filka. Doesn't really, yeah, it doesn't really, yeah, it does sound filthy. There's a bike trail that we're gonna try and do. It's about five miles there and back. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes. We parked a little bit away from the trailhead, but that's because we couldn't find any parking. Yeah, this is it. <laughs> they got had an electric bike. So this is like our second time kind of on a trail like this with our unicycles. Nice. So we're taking a little break. It's not even, no, it's not in five minutes because of the incline and we're putting a lot of pressure on our legs. I brought my trusty Fuji X-T4. That was a nice little jerky break. I thought in the beginning I wouldn't be able to wouldn't be able to um, like carry a camera with me while riding these things. We made it to chair two. The wheel feels great. Definitely there's a lot of balance. Oh god. <laughs> but it's definitely fun. I do prefer this better than cruising around, you know, the city. This is the trail for it. I think it's camping though, you can camp here. Lower camp, yeah, campgrounds. So we're here at the, what used to be a campsite, I think, of the Henningern Flats. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty abandoned here. <laughs> What I wanted to do today is not only just ride the wheels and take pictures, but take pictures with my phone. There's this app called Filka. Filka, you buy it for three bucks and then you get to have, I guess, LUTs on your photographs. So I just wanted to test that out today. That's the Filka app, so I'm gonna turn it on. Okay. Oh, right now I have it to T-Max. Probably won't be able to see it that well on the screen. So you're able to change the shutter speed and then you can change your ISO here. Or if you tap in, it'll just figure it out for you. Unfortunately, I'm still trying to figure out how to, um, I'll just take this picture here. But I'm not sure how to adjust the aperture on this app. So I want to test out the Kodak Portra 400 simulation. I want to see what that looks like. This is cool. Yeah, I wonder if I get to, if it takes control of RAW. Yeah, watch out for rattlesnakes. It's nice. Took a picture of Ani here. Cute. From what I remember, portrait film really brings out the red, so I'm gonna go over here and take a picture of this truck. Unfortunately, I don't have like a controlled test. It's not like I have a 35 millimeter camera with Kodak Portra compared side to side with this app. There's E100G. Oh, let's try the gold 400 first. Cool. Here's the E100. It's pretty interesting. And then of course you can go into it and then adjust, choose your frame if you want. It's pretty cool.